okay so the first step is we have to um, you know get this all this this one then we have this yes, dalcini le liye hai ye ho gaya apna seeds then we have this one then we have this one then we have this one then we have cloves then we have this coconut you know coconut powder and then we have these leaves onions small onions finally it becomes like this yes, so today we are doing chicken chettina so first step is you have to put this cardamom chicken chettina recipe then first step cardamom then the next is then we have the seeds cinnamon then we have cloves Oh. Side pakka do kuch. Yeah, then we have this fennel leaf seeds. Cumin. Then the cumin seed. then red chilies dry red chilies so okay so once you have that then uh, you will finally add this uh, this black pepper yeah yeah so all these are like one tablespoon okay so once you have this then will in dry flame you will just kind of heat it isko thoda garam karna hai dry flame mein okay garam karna hai ise low flame mein gas ko thoda kam karke main dikha deta hu gas kitna rakhna hai pura low flame mein isko thoda aise garam karna hai देखिए जैसे कलर हो गया थोड़ा कलर होने के बाद देख रहे हैं थोड़ा कलर हो रहा है थोड़ा गर्म हो रहा है उसके बाद इसको हम लोग ग्राइंड करेंगे ओके तो ग्राइंड करने का प्रोसेस में मैं बताता हूँ सो द नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज विल एड दिस कोकोनट यू नो ड्राई कोकोनट प्रली विल एड लाइक हाफ कप हाफ कप मोर देन लिटिल हाफ कप ऑफ ड्राई कोकोनट ओके दैट्स इट या सो लाइक हाफ कप ऑफ ड्राई कोकोनट देन अगेन उसको लो फ्लोम लो फ्लेम में थोड़ा इसको ऐसे चलाना है लो फ्लेम में जैसे ये भी थोड़ा गर्म हो जाए यू नो देखते हैं इसको थोड़ा गर्म करते हैं इसको थोड़ा चला चला इसको थोड़ा गर्म करना है इसको इसके बाद ये सबको मिक्स कर देना है अभी इसको कितना देर चलाना है जैसे कि कोकोनट का कलर थोड़ा ये हो जाए मतलब रेडिस रेडिश नहीं थोड़ा ब्राउनिश थोड़ा हो जाएगा और इसको पूरा लो फ्लेम में ही चलाना है भाई लोग देख रहे हैं देखिए किसी कलर फूट फूट के आ रहा है मजा आ जाएगा जब लास्ट को बनेगा बस 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 देख रहे हैं मैंने क्या किया है ना इस रेड चिली को मतलब तोड़ा नहीं है इसको टू पीसेस कर देना है मैं भूल गया करने के लिए मैं इसे अभी ट्राई कर रहा हूँ उसको काटने के लिए नहीं हो रहा है बट यार आपको उसको तोड़ के डालना है ये एक लेकिन मैं जब ग्राइंडिंग करूँगा इसको तोड़ दूंगा सोच रहा हूँ ठीक कलर थोड़ा थोड़ा आ गया है थोड़ा फ्लेम को थोड़ा बढ़ा रहा हूँ
now uh, you can see that the color has been changed to the brownish little bit brownish color so now it's time to take that out and ready for grind grinding so maine abhi isko gas ko band kar dena hai abhi isko thoda thanda hone ke liye chhod dena hai so keep it some for some time to cool like this spread it out cool it and then you do the grinding you can see now the color has been changed now you can see this we have put it in a plate so that it can cool for some time and then i'll put it in the grinder so that we can grind this and make a you know powder of this entire uh, dry you know dry flavors of different uh, you know seeds or different you know coriander powder all this this recipe powders okay see it smells really good so you can also try it uh, I mean, definitely try this in your home, right? Because this is so cool, and it will taste really good at the end of the uh, process. So stay tuned. More things coming up. Uh, I'll show you the exact process, how you add this, how you cook, and how you add the chicken. So stay tuned towards the end of the video, and do like, share, and subscribe if you haven't done this, because really good, good, exciting food videos are coming up soon. So next step is ये जो हम लोग का अभी ठंडा हो गया है. अभी इसको इस ग्राइंडर में डाल के इसको ग्राइंड करना है ठीक है तो अभी हम लोग डालेंगे इसको अभी ये पूरा डालने के बाद तो अभी हम लोग का ये हो गया है वेडी इसको अभी ग्राइंडर में डाल के ओके सो फाइनली हम लोग का रेडी हो गया है मैं दिखा देता हूँ देखिए पूरा ग्राइंड ओ जो स्मेल आ रहा है ना सो इट्स सो डिलीशियस स्मेल इज सो गुड सो नाउ दिस इज रेडी सो आई सो यू द नेक्स्ट प्रोसेस सो लेट्स सी नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज इसको ये जो प्याज है दीज आर लाइक द स्मॉल ओनियन सो दिस इज वेरी गुड फॉर दिस रेसिपी चिकन चेटी नाट यू टू गेट द स्मॉल ओनियन बट इफ यू बिग ओनियन दैट्स फाइन बट इफ द स्पून ओनियन स्मॉल ओनियन गेट्स मोर यू नो स्पाइसी थिंग और इस फ्लेवर टू दैट चिकन चेटी नाट सो आई हैव कट दिस इन टू द स्मॉल स्मॉल पीसेस यू कैन सी एंड देन फाइनली आई विल एड दैट फॉर फ्राइंग इन द पैन ओके लेट्स ओके नेक्स्ट स्टेप ये हम टेकिंग द फ्राइंग पैन इसमें हम लोग डालेंगे ये दिस इज द मस्टर्ड ऑयल मस्टर्ड ऑयल डाबर का सो विल ऐड बिकॉज आई हैव टेकन वन किलो ऑफ चिकन सो प्रली आई लैड लाइक लिटिल बेट आई एम नॉट आई एम यूजिंग लेस ऑयल दिस ऑयल आई हैव टेकन राइट I'll just spread it so that it spreads across, and still you can see my flame is at low. Okay. Now the next. Step. Okay. So the next step is basically ye curry patta leaves hai. So these are like curry patta leaves. So I'll just uh, get couple of them. So I'll. Take a little bit more because it adds a very good, uh, you know, flavor to the. I'm adding this much for a one kilo chicken, so I'll just wash it for some. Uh, I'll wash it and clean it, and then really I'll add it to fry. Okay. Add the curry powder leaves. Just to wash a couple of more, I added. So once I will add this, then what I will do is now these are my cut onions. So I'll add all these onions to it. Okay. 
So now the onions are added. Okay. This curvy will make it a little bit uh, kind of onion when it comes to like yellowish color. Then we'll add the uh, masala, the grinded masala and chicken to it. Let's go to the chicken section now for the marination. Okay, so now the next step is adding tomatoes. So now cook this until tomato becomes soft. The one got inside, so we'll add it. So let's cook it until it becomes soft, the tomato. So increase the flame to high. In high flame, cook it so the tomato becomes soft and then we'll go to the next step. Okay, so now it's now tomato has been cooked and now we'll add the ginger garlic paste. Two spoon you have to add for one kg chicken. So one should add in. I'll just mix it. Do not add more uh, ginger garlic because the actual flavor in is there in our grinded uh, dry masala. So only add two tablespoon of ginger garlic. So once it's done. Now leave it for some time so that the masala or the ginger garlic paste, the onions, the tomatoes, the curry, pasta, everything gets cooked well. I'll just cover it. You know, I'll just cover it. So see you. Okay, so here our marinated chicken. So I forgot to show you that, but let me explain you. So what all I have added. So this is the raw chicken, one kg. Then I have added the, um, you know, the meat or the chicken masala. Then I added some curd. Now finally I'm adding some lemons to it because it will add some, you know, kind of a tangy flavor. Uh, and you uh, you have to add the turmeric. That's it. It's pretty simple, right? Because as I said, the main uh, flavor will come out of this grounded uh, or the grinded masala, dry masala, right? So now it's ready. So it's pretty simple. Chicken, again, I'm repeating chicken, the chicken masala. Uh, then now come you know the haldi or the turmeric powder then curd and lemon so everything is one tablespoon for one gay chicken so now i'll just mix it well All right so mix it properly and then i will keep it for two hours of marination okay after two hours let me bring that okay now this ginger garlic this paste is kind of ready this is cooked well cooked the smell is coming you should uh, sense that smell okay now well, let's add the chicken the marinated chicken see your oh, the marination is really good so keep it at least for two hours inside a freezer so that the masala and everything gets uh, you know some mil jayega jise uske andar jise ghusna chahiye chicken ke andar these masala and all Okay, so uh, everything uh, is now added. So the final step is add to that, uh, you know, that grounded or uh, the grinded or the toasted, uh, you know, this uh, raw or the dry masala. So I'll just mix it properly. Once I mix it, I will a little bit. Of... Yeah, I lost my. Okay, so let's cook that properly. Let's mix it properly. Okay, now the final thing, the best part is that toasted dry masalas. Everything will add it and I will just mix it. I'll just show how it looks like you see this is so good this will bring the actual test or the chicken chetinad test okay. mix it properly and then leave it to cook for at least like you know 15 minutes under low flame okay okay so five minutes is done you can see the water is coming out of the chicken i haven't added water until yet so you see a lot of water coming out I'll just mix it properly and add some salt namak swad anusar add some salt to it and if you want some spicy uh, or more spicy then add some you know green chilies or 
kashmiri uh, lal powder red chili powder okay but as i do not have uh, to eat a lot of spicy things so and also i've added a lot of uh, chilies while marination of the chicken so i'll not add now but still let's add some kashmiri chili i'll just show you Okay, okay. So now we have our catch Kashmiri chili powder. Just add. Uh, I'll add a little bit just to have some uh, reddish or a very good color to it, and little spicy. Add like one tablespoon, but yeah, it depends on you. If you want more spicy, okay. So I've added. Okay, now I'll just again uh, mix it, and then I will now this time I will cover it and keep it to uh, you know boil for at least fifteen minutes, and then I will remove the lid out of it. So that by that it will be ready. The chicken chetinad is ready as this is South Indian dish. So you can see there are a lot of curry leaves over here, and then uh, it will be a little bit spicy because South Indian dish is a little bit spicy and it tastes really good. Okay, let's check after 15 minutes. Let me show you now. The chicken chetinad is almost ready. So open. It took around like twenty minutes. Some log dale hai. Iske andar, matlab we have put it into heat twenty minutes. And now you can see the color. I'll just zoom a bit. Oh wow wow wow. Okay, so finally our chicken chetty nard is ready. See the flavor. Oh wow. And with that you can have rice. We can have roti, some onion, some lemons, and some chilies. So look at this. Oh god. I will take this one bite. I will show you how it tastes. See this? Oh, oh my God! This is so soft, so delicious. You know? Okay. So hope you guys enjoy this, and uh, see you guys in my next vlog.